I'm back everyone. I was trying to get Totaka's song to play, but it's not working. Maybe it has to be a little later, I don't know. I thought it was just after a completed cave. Whatever, anyway. Pigman! My eye is twitching. Oh my god, I'm going to go insane. Eh, uh, what is, what is, who now? You have successfully returned to the planet, sir. So excellent decision making, gentlemen. We must celebrate this like reflecting expedition. We've got a large amount of data and in-depth analysis. I'll send a report back. And the day automatically ends, I think. For whatever reason. Not that it matters how many days that we have, but whatever. And there's nothing else for us to do here, but still, I would like to get a couple more Pikmin before the day ends. Whatever. Apparently it's possible to beat this game in like nine or seven days. I've seen a Big Dip's run of it. It's pretty interesting. Also, and since the purple Pikmin don't have an onion, they just don't. And they just get stored in the ship. Don't ask. I don't know why the purple Pikmin don't have an onion. It's weird. I wonder if the rock Pikmin or the weird flying Pikmin are going to be like that. I still haven't seen it, heard any information about the weird flying Pikmin, other than, like, if you look real closely in the trailer, and by look closely, I mean not that closely. Pretty obvious. Today's report. We got some crap done. Quenching emblem. And, uh, we got, we gained a bunch of Pikmin. We haven't lost any Pikmin so far, so, yeah. Sunset, fire, water, electricity, explosion, poison. Yellow Pikmin don't even uh, carry bomb rocks in this game. All right, something in my eye. Baby steps. I think it's really in my eye. What the fudge? Yay! But yeah, we can't do anything until uh, we get more Pikmin types, so. We go to go to the new area! Awakening Wood! Ha ha ha. I think this is an area, I think all these areas, again, I think all these areas are from Pikmin 1, but I can't exactly remember which one is which. I think the, I think that first area was supposed to be the final trial, and this is supposed to be like the second level in the game in Pikmin 1, but yeah, purple Pikmin are in here. I'll take them out. I want to find some nectar. But I'm not sure where that is. Ah! He's about to lead all my Pikmin into water, to their watery graves. What do you want? Louie here has all my to you the specificities of the Pikmin form groups based on color with the Pikmin band able Z, Pick A, the Pick P, Pikmin, push B to switch, blah blah blah. Dumb computer. Freaking we are out. I want reds to grab this. Purples are cool, but like they're slow. So if I'm gonna have, if I'm gonna be carrying back things, I want uh, reds to do it. I think uh, purples will carry it to whatever onion. Well, why are you all going after that? You know there was another flower. So anyway, actually, I'll show off what purple, how purple Pikmin are OP in a second. Okay, you guys ready to see how uh, purple Pikmin are OP? A poor guy never stood a chance. Again, Pikmin keep going back to the back of the group. Guys, what are you guys doing? Hello. Yeah, Pikmin sprout to do a little sprout. Pikmin little little Pikmin sprout a lot faster. Before you had to, they went into the ground, you had to wait like five years. But yeah, purple Pikmin are pretty OP. It's also very slow, so I don't want them carrying anything. God, I said I... Freaking Wiimote. 
I really need a better setup for my Wii Remote. There we go. Anyway, let's pick some Pikmin. We were like right there to on um, the onion. I have no idea why I even cared. They were taking too long, damn it. That probably wasted more time. Whatever. In this game, I'm a lot more uh, tempted to screw around because uh, we don't have a day limit. We do have a time limit, but like we can go up to how many, however many days we want. In fact, the game rewards you if you go past 60. You can find like special bugs that give you lots of stuffs. But I will try to not use that, even though I will be terribly tempted. And we have 90 Pikmin. I guess let's just screw around. Let's, I mean, not screw around, try to get stuff done. Ah! These things! Butts. This game doesn't have a... Another thing I like about Pikmin uh, 2 over 1 is uh, it doesn't have a lot, as many annoying enemies. But the annoying enemies that were in Pikmin 1 are a lot easier to take care of. Mostly because of the OP Pikmin. OP purple Pikmin. Oh god. Yay, the thing drops things if you hit it. And it's easy to hit it with purple Pikmin. Purple Pikmin are OP. If I made this clear yet. I think there is an item up here. Actually, no, I think we can, there is an item up here. Ooh! I want you. Freaking, I want the Wii Remote to behave properly. Whatever. No, don't drink! Pile of crap. Yeah, you never see buds in this game. Because they're norm they normally, uh, you have plenty of uh, nectar to uh, make them flowers. And uh, to make like all of them flowers so they don't progress to it naturally. And all the enemies that downgraded uh, Pikmin from flowers to buds in the last game are either not in here or they just drag it down to directly to leaves. Alright, let's see if we can't get as many Pikmin as possible to benefit from this. See, look, it's a lot easier to get a bunch of Pikmin, uh, get a lot of Pikmin nectar in this game than it is in the other game. Come on, drink the nectar. Although in the Wii version, it's not as easy. Yeah, that Pikmin stumbled. He didn't trip. That's interesting. Yay, now we have faster Pikmin. Which is good. And now we have a bunch of other slower Pikmin. But it's fine! Drag you back to the ship. I want to get like a hundred Pikmin so stuff can happen. Anyway, look at this stuff. Climb, my friends. Climb! Climb the great vine of happiness or something. I don't know. What's happening? Oh, are there a hundred Pikmin out? There are like 95 since there's like five Pikmin. That need to be discovered. Omar, we have a problem. Omar ceased ejecting. Maybe it's malfunctioning. Interesting. It now seems that the life forms within the onion has increased. Yeah, you can only have 100 Pikmin out at a time. If there's only nine pick, pick, five Pikmin. Maybe they're wild Pikmin. That's a good theory. An accurate theory. More or less. <laughs> So right, now that we have uh, a bunch of Pikmin, let's uh, try to see if we can uh, get them all flowers. Yay! You can't tell if I'm rotating this at all. Stunning, this red berry contains ultra spicy essence. We need uh, more. The robot demands more. I think he needs like 10 or something, or 5. It's either 10 or 5, I'm pretty sure it's 10. Can I, like, decrease the... Oh, here we go. It's down on the D-pad. Which is useful. So then I can just grab all these Pikmin and... No! Fudge! Damn it! Wii Remote. You know what? I'm freaking still not used to the stupid Wii Remote. Maybe if I change, like, the center bar? The center bar keeps effing up on me. Okay. I'm good! So now I just have, like, two leaves. It's fine. I'm, I'm fine with that. 
Anyway, let's have most of our Pikmin. Actually, I don't know how many Pikmin we need on that. Whatever, let's just... Climb! I wonder if I can get one to fall on me. Take it back, and the rest of you can work on this wall. Or grab that thing. That thing drops nectar. Oh, wow, those things grew back. There we go. I guess I'll grab more of them! Again, in this game, I'm way more tempted to screw around. Yay! He did something with it. Captain Olimar, my research on the red berries you discovered yield a powerful potion. Behold, the ultra spicy spray. Although it is untested, I believe it will have particular results. Spray it on your Pikmin by two, blah, blah, blah. One bottle, spray your ten berries. But yeah, it basically uh, turns all your Pikmin into super Pikmin. For like a cup, for a little bit, which is really helpful for tearing down walls. I think. Look at that! I was able to whistle all those Pikmin from all the way over here. Which is why playing on the Wii version is beneficial. I don't know, Wii version both ha has its uh, advantages and disadvantages. You can whistle Pikmin really far, but it's harder to like bunch them together and you can't throw them that. You can, I think, uh, the throwing speed. You can't do the really fast throwing trick that you could in Pikmin the other game. I always get freaked out whenever I see those flowers for a particular river, particular reason. Yeah, I think I do remember this area. Like, maybe this was, like, the landing area, and then, like, that. I don't know. Stupid bug. Hang hey, up. Uh, can I get my other Pikmin? Come on. Yay! Please take the most indirect route towards me as possible. Thank you. Anyway, these, uh, the darker the wall is, the stronger it is. You probably figure that out for yourself. Where's the one Pikmin that is? Is it, like, over here somewhere? Oh, yeah. Come on, little Pikmin. Yeah, I don't have the ability to lie down. Taking the Wii does doesn't really do anything, by the way. It'd be neat if you had to do that to throw Pikmin, but that'd be kind of a pain in the ass after a while. I'm still very disappointed that there's no Pokemon game for the Wii where you shake the Wii Remote to throw the Pokeball. I don't know, that. I remember that was something I really, really wanted to do when the Wii first came out, and I was younger and dumber. It still sounds cool. Hell it! Thank you. Drop him. There you go. Oh boy. I'm scared. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's not what I told you to do. Oh yeah, that flower has eyeballs. That flower has eyeballs. Don't worry, don't even worry about that one, dude. Uh, kill it! Oh my god, if I had my first Pikmin loss, I'm so devastated. I hope it wasn't a purple. Was it a purple? It was a purple! <laughs> uh, oh, crap. I don't like those things. 200! need more purples for that. Let's see if I can, uh, quickly, uh, get in this cave before the end of the day. Actually, you know what? You guys, come here. I don't care if I have, like, 94. Ah, I don't like creepy... Those things are called creepy clinthiums. Or crepiflanthiums. Yeah, it's the hole. Where's my 95th Pikmin? I might get the hole. Flame resistant Pikmin, blah blah blah. Okay, where's the freaking Pikmin? Freaking Wii Remote. Oh, 
Where the hell is he? I only have 93 out of 94. Where the hell is the last Pikmin? Heck, man! Louis, you stay here. What the hell is he doing? I always get super paranoid about stuff like this. Where the hell is he? supposed to be around here, isn't he? Oh, he's right over there. Heck, man, why are you so careless? I have to carry you back. Okay, let's quickly get in the hole. I got the Pikmin. Let's go. Oh, you come too. I don't know if you can leave the thing, but yeah, here it says uh, what uh, bad things are in there. Right here it says flames. So, uh, it's just helpful to bring in, uh, the proper amount of Pikmin that you need. The game has been saved! Yay! The game has been saved! Whistle back. Thank you. You can wear remote. The things, like, fall from the sky here. I'm scared. Freaking, why? I have a purple leaf. Pain the ass. Hoping like something useful falls from the sky here. Oh, where should I go? I think it's more useful to go on the back. Trying to resist the urge to pick up every single dead body. Again, purple Pikmin. Should be something in here. Ah, too many. Too many! Too many! Ah, oh, they're dying! Crap, this bad is happening! Stupid butt! I said, stupid butt, give me back my Pikmin. Thank you. And we get a D pad, yay. This is just lovely. Ah, glitchy. Whoa. Okay. I'm good! Switching to Omar or Louie or whatever the you call him. And why not? Let's try to drag back a bunch of bodies. Clean up, crew. Yay. Stone of Glory. We got a D pad. Just have them grab some. Dead bodies. I don't know why some are worth uh, one, some are worth two. Okay, that does work. I keep getting paranoid. But it doesn't matter what your. So I'm assuming it doesn't matter what your Pikmin is doing. Uh, they go down in the hole with you nonetheless. So I will finish off the hole of beast next time on Pikmin 2. Yay.